Well, let's just uh, settle into our meditation posture. So just whatever has been going on for you today. I mean, the most amazing thing is the best thing about this session and our practice tonight is that you showed up, that you're actually here. So anything beyond being here is a bonus. So it's always a good start. So, and and however it is you're showing up tonight, just know that that is perfectly fine. That's just exactly where you're at. So check your posture, feet, if they're flat on the ground, really do try and connect in your mind with the earth that's supporting you. And be sitting on top of your sits bones and imagine your spine is a string of pearls of light. And shoulders aligned with the hips. And just lengthen that spine longer, longer, longer. I don't think uh, Mary's able to make it for a couple of days. Anyway, we're just, she'll be thinking of us. And tip the head forward very slightly. Just a little bit of traction in the back of the neck. Eyes are down, tip of the tongue is on the roof of the mouth, relax the jaw. And then just release any tension in the body from the crown of the head all the way down through the body, through the limbs. Take a nice deep breath. And just be aware if there are any um, sounds in your environment. And just allow those sounds to be there without needing to run off and investigate. And then just notice the thoughts that might be arising. So try and put some space in between the thoughts as they arise. And if you like, you can put your thoughts on each thought on an individual little white fluffy cloud and just allow that to float away without any judgment, without any criticism, without any grasping. You can take a step back. And imagine you're like a scientist, an objective observer, just watching what's going on in the mind with curiosity and compassion and love. And then let's just bring to mind all the people of our life very briefly, the ones we love, those we don't, and then there's those strangers, remembering they can all change place at any time trying not to take the ones we love for granted. And then there's those people in our life, um, you know, sorry. And then those, those, this friend, this enemy and the stranger, think of them as all being equal, same as you and me. So we tend to elevate our friends, prioritize them. But actually they're all, everybody's exactly the same and they wish to be happy they wish to be free from suffering and having this extraordinary capacity for an enlightened mind i think we're doing this meditation this evening for the benefit of all these people and by extension all sentient beings and think again just bring to mind israel who passed away last week this was his main practice so we can imagine we're doing it on his behalf. And also, of course, this ongoing 
this should be in our mind constantly, this, this wish, this prayer, this aspiration for Rinpoche to return, uh, reincarnation to return as quickly as possible. So, so I think there is no negativity that cannot be purified. And I really think that we need to remember that rather than just, you know, taking upon ourselves our faults, giving ourselves a hard time continuously about our faults. The thing is to know it can be dealt with and just to let it go, moving, moving on forward. Just keep moving forward. You know, deal with it, move forward. And this is the basis of this practice. So this is a psychological practice. Um, we can deal with a lot of negativity that's on our mind. It's our psychology. We can also counteract that with uh, positive thinking, which is basically what this whole practice is about. So we start with the power of regret. So sincerely regret from the depths of your heart anything you've done to harm any living being with your uh, body. In this day, in this life, and in all past lives, not just your body, your, your speech as well. And think of uh, specific actions of the body and the speech. And then just in general, things that you can't remember, just regret all. And the reason to regret is based on this logic of karma, and we experience everything due to our past karma, our past actions, and having harmed others we ourselves will necessarily experience suffering in the future. And we cannot bear the thought of the future suffering that we will experience. And we know from our present suffering that we uh, don't want any more. So logically, it makes sense to remove those karmic seeds before they ripen as future suffering for us. So think like this. I regret from the depths of my heart having harmed others with my body and my speech having broken my vows because I do not want the future suffering, I'm sick of suffering, and also regret any anger, attachment, and the rest that are the cause of why we harm others, and think again, I'm sick of this suffering, our delusions, causing us so much suffering, and then think, what can I do about it? Whom can I turn to? So here we come to the power of reliance. So we rely upon, we turn to the Buddha, the doctor, who has the methods that we can use to purify and it's not that we need the Buddha to forgive us. We're purifying ourselves by relying upon his method. So imagine Bhadrasattva above the crown of your head. You can also imagine this is your teacher manifesting in this form for your benefit. And just imagine he's made of this <clears throat> radiant, uh, blissful white light. So just imagine he's there on the crown of your head, this blissful light Buddha. You can also imagine um, if we have a teacher, this is the mind of your teacher manifesting in this form for your benefit. So he's sitting cross-legged on a white lotus and a moon cushion. He has this beautiful radiant face. His eyes are long. They're shaped like lotus petals, and they're full of love and compassion for you and all those people of your life. He has a sweet red mouth. His hair is black and held up in a top knot. His arms are crossed at his heart. The left underneath the right, the left is holding a bell representing wisdom, and the right is holding a vajra, which represents the indestructibility of compassion, and there being crossed represents the union of these two, and this symbolizes enlightenment itself, the development of infinite wisdom and infinite compassion. To the Buddha, the Dharma, and the Sangha, I go for refuge until I'm enlightened. By this practice of meditating on Guru Vajrasattva, may I reach Buddhahood, so as to benefit all sentient beings. So in order to develop compassion, we need to rely upon other beings and the very beings we have harmed and those who have harmed us, excuse me, by developing compassion for them. And think particularly of people you have harmed recently and in the past and then in general, all beings we have ever harmed since beginning this time. And then remember those who have harmed you and have compassion for them because they're going to suffer as a result of the harm they've caused you and the suffering they've caused you. So make it just a strong aspiration to do this practice of purification for the sake of all these beings and think, I must purify for their sake. And now we come to the power of the remedy. And this is the actual medicine doing the practice of purification. And we start with the body. And Bhadrasapa very compassionately 
sends powerful white nectar, like coming out of a hose, quite forcefully from his heart, and it arcs around and enters your crown and pours into your entire body, filling you completely, and it keeps pouring into you until it forces out of your lower orifices all the harm you've ever done to any living being with your body in the form of inky liquid. And this pours out of you and disappears into space, got one atom left as we recite the mantra. Om Bajrasapasamaya Manupalaya Vajrasapa Dina Patita Dita Meboa Sutokaya Meboa Supokaya Meboa Anarakta Meboa Sawasidi Mempi Yatsa Sawakama Sutta Me Sitam Shriam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Me Mutsa Vajrabawa Mahasamaya Sata A Hom Pe Vajrasapasamaya Manupalaya Vajrasapa Dina Patita Dido meboa, sutokaya meboa, supokaya meboa, anarakta meboa, sawa sidi mimpi yata sawa kama sita me, sitam shriam kuru hum ha 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 ho bagoan, sawa tata gata vajama me mutta vajabawa mahasamaya sapa a hum pe, vajasapa samaya manupalaya vajasapa dina patita, dido meboa, sutokaya meboa, supokaya meboa, anarakta meboa, sawa sidi mimpi yata sawa kama sita me, Sitam Shriam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajama Mimutta Vajabawa Mahasamaya Satra A Hom Pe Ambajasapa Samaya Manupalaya Vajasapa Dina Patita Dida Meboa Zutokaya Meboa Supokaya Meboa Anarakta Meboa Sawa Sidi Mimpi Yatsa Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajama Mimutta Vajabawa Mahasamaya Satra A Hom Pe Vajrasapa Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapa Dina Patita Dida Meboa Sutokaya Meboa Supokaya Meboa Anarakta Meboa Sawa Sidi Mimpi Yatsa Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Mimutta Vajrabawa Mahasamaya Satra A Hum Pe Vajrasapa Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapa Dina Patita Dida Meboa Sutokaya Meboa Supokaya Meboa Anarakta meboa, sawa sidi mimpi yata sawa kama sita me. Sitam shriam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan. Sawa tata gata vajrama me mutta vajrabawa mahasamaya sapa a hum pe. Vajrasapa samaya manupalaya vajrasapa dina patita. Dida meboa, sutokaya meboa, supokaya meboa. Anarakta meboa, sawa sidi mimpi yata sawa kama sita me. Sitam Shriam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Me Mutta Vajrabawa Mahasamaya Satra A Hum Pe So be delighted that all the harm you've ever done to any sentient being with your body is now completely purified and think there's no way you could do anything but benefit others now with your body. So the next is a purification of the speech, and Vajrasattva now very happily sends powerful nectar from his heart chakra, and it arcs around and forcefully enters your crown and fills your entire body, except this time forcing up to the top of your body all the negativity of your speech, which overflows and disappears into space, not one atom left. So just imagine all the gossip and the harsh speech and the useless speech and lying, talking badly about others behind their backs, <clears throat> All of this is purified by this powerful nectar filling you as we recite the mantra. Om Vajrasapa Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapa Dina Patita Dira Meboa Sutokaya Meboa Supokaya Meboa Anarakta Meboa Sawa Sidi Mimpi Yata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Mimutta Vajrabawa Mahasamaya Satra A Hum Pe Vajrasapa Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapa Dina Patita Dira Meboa Sutokaya Meboa Supokaya Meboa Anarakta meboa, sawa sidi mimpi yata sawa kama sita me. Sitam shriam kuru hum, ha 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 ho bhagawan. Sawa tata gata vajrama me mutta vajrabawa mahasamaya sata a hum pe. Vajrasapa samaya manupalaya vajrasapa dina patita. Dida meboa, sutokaya meboa, supokaya meboa. Anarakta meboa, sawa sidi mimpi yata sawa kama sita me. Sitam shriam kuru hum, ha 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 ho bhagawan. Sawa tata gata vajrama. Vajrama me mutta vajrabawa mahasamaya satra a hum pe. Vajrasapa samaya manupalaya vajrasapa dina patita. 
Tiro me boa, zito kaya me boa, zipo kaya me boa, anorakta me boa, sawa siri me piyata sawa kama sita me. Sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan. Sawa tata gata vajrama me mutsa vajrabawa maha samaya satra a hum pe. Ambajo sapa samaya manupalaya vajra sapa dina patita. Dido me boa, zito kaya me boa, zipo kaya me boa. Anarakta me boa, sawa siri me piyata sawa kama sita me. Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Me Mutsa Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Satra A Hum Pe Ambajra Sapa Samaya Manupalaya Vajra Sapa Dina Patita Tiru Me Boa Zuto Kaya Me Boa Supo Kaya Me Boa Anurakta Me Boa Sawa Siddhi Me Piyata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Me Mutsa Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Satra A Hum Pe Ambajra Sapa Samaya Manupalaya Vajra Sapa Dina Patita Tiru Me Boa Sito Kaya Me Boa Supo Kaya Me Boa Anurakta Me Boa Sawa Siddhi Me Piyata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Me Mutsa Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Satra A Hum Pei so I feel so happy that your speech is now completely purified and imagine it's not possible to do anything but benefit others now with your speech. And the next is a purification of the mind and imagine Vajrasattva now very compassionately sends powerful beams of light from his heart chakra and this arcs around and enters your crown and fills your entire being. So it's just the same as when you walk into a pitch black room and you flick on that switch. It instantly dispels the darkness. So try that. I keep forgetting, actually. But try, next time you talk, walk into a dark room, imagine the, the light is dispelling the darkness, not I'm just switching on the light. <clears throat> and then you just apply it to your own delusion. So the light from Vajrasapa's heart hits your heart chakra, and immediately all the delusions of de depression, anxiety, and anger, and bitterness, and grudges, and jealousy, and all of this kind of muck that's in our mind, instantly dispelled by that light. Um Bajrasapa Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapa Dina Patita Dida Meboa Sutokaya Meboa Supokaya Meboa Anarakta Meboa Sawa Sidi Mimpi Yata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Mimutsa Vajrabawa Mahasamaya Sata A Hum Pe Um Bajrasapa Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapa Dina Patita Tiru me boa, suto kaya me boa, supo kaya me boa, anorakta me boa, sawa siri me piyata sawa kama sita me. Sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan, sawa tata gata vajrama me mutta vajrabawa maha samaya satra a hum pe. Ambhajra sapa samaya manupalaya vajra sapa dina patita. Tiru me boa, suto kaya me boa, supo kaya me boa, anorakta me boa, sawa siri me piyata sawa kama sita me. Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Me Mutsa Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Satra A Hum Pe Ambhajra Sapa Samaya Manupalaya Vajra Sapa Dina Patita Tiru Me Boa Suto Kaya Me Boa Supo Kaya Me Boa Anurakta Me Boa Sawa Siri Me Piyata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Me Mutsa Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Satra A Hum Pe Ambhajra Sapa Samaya Manupalaya Vajra Sapa Dina Patita Tiru Me Boa Sito Kaya Me Boa Sipo Kaya Me Boa Anurakta Me Boa Sawa Siri Me Piyata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Me Mutsa Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Satra A Hum Pe Ambhajra Sapa Samaya Manupalaya Vajra Sapa Dina Patita Tiru Me Boa Sito Kaya Me Boa Sipo Kaya Me Boa Anurakta Me Boa Sawa Siri Me Piyata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Me Mutsa Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Satra A Hum Pe Ambhajra Sapa Samaya Manupalaya Vajra Sapa Dina Patita Tiru Me Boa Sito Kaya Me Boa Supo Kaya Me Boa Anurakta Me Boa Sawa Siri Me Piyata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Me Mutsa Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Satra A Hum Pay. 
So again, be delighted that all your delusions, which are the cause of or the source of our own suffering, cause of why we are mothers with our body and our speech, and imagine they're just all gone. And imagine now there's no space in your heart for anything other than love and kindness and forgiveness and wisdom and bliss and compassion. So next is the purification of the imprints of negativity of the body, speech, and mind. And imagine that Vajrasattva sends light and nectar, and it fills you completely and eradicates even the subtlest imprints of negative energy from the mind. Oh, Vajrasattva Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasattva Dina Patita. Excuse me, Dino Meboa, Sutokaya Meboa, Supokaya Meboa, Anarakta Meboa, Sawasidi, Mempi Yatsa Sawakama Sita Me, Sutam Shriam Kuru Hum, Ho Bago, and Sawa Tata Gata Vajama Me Mutsa Vajabawa, Mahasamaya Sapa Ah Hom Pe, and Bajasapa Samaya Manupalaya, Bajasapa Dina Patita, Dino Meboa, Sutokaya Meboa, Supokaya Meboa, Anarakta meboa sawasidi mempi yatta sawa kama sita me. Sitam shriyam karu hum ha 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 ho bhagavan. Sawa tata gata vajrama me mutsa vajrabawa maha samaya sattva a hum pe. Vajrasapa samaya manupalaya vajrasapa dina patita. Dira meboa sutokaya meboa supokaya meboa. Anarakta meboa sawasidi mempi yatta sawa kama sita me. Sitam Shriam Guru Hum Ha Ho Bhagavan Sawatata Gata Vajrama Me Mutsa Vajrabawa Mahasamaya Sapa Ah Hum Pe Ambaja Sapa Samaya Manupalaya Vajra Sapa Dina Patita Dira Meboa Sutokaya Meboa Supokaya Meboa Anarakta Meboa Sawasidi Mempi Yatsa Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriam Guru Hum Ha Ha Ho Bhagavan Sawatata Gata Vajrama Me Mutsa Vajrabawa Mahasamaya Sapa Ah Hum Pe Ambaja Sapa Samaya Manupalaya Vatra Sapa Dina Patita Tita Meboa Sutokaya Meboa Supokaya Meboa Anarakta Meboa Sawasidi Mimpi Yatta Sawa Kama Sita Me Sutam Shriam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagavan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Mimutsa Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Satra Ah Hum Pe Ambaja Sapa Samaya Manupalaya Vatra Sapa Dina Patita Tita Meboa Sutokaya Meboa Supokaya Meboa Anarakta meboa sawasidi mempi yatta sawa kama sita me. Sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagavan. Sawa tata gata vajrama me mutsa vajrabawa maha samaya sattva a hum pe. Ambhajra sapa samaya manupalaya vajra sapa dina patita. Tita meboa sutokaya meboa supokaya meboa. Anurakta meboa sawasidi mempi yatta sawa kama sita me. Sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagavan. Sawa tata gata vajrama me mutsa vajrabawa maha samaya sattva a hum pe. So now feel you're completely purified. Not one atom of negativity is left in your mind stream. Even the subtlest obscurations to your enlightenment have been removed. So now we come to the power of resolve, and this is the fourth and quite crucial step. This is just because it's so simple. We just have to make a decision to try and refrain from harming. And I think sometimes the harm comes as a result of the motivation behind an action. So I think we do need to keep our mind in check. And then we can also make a strong aspiration to refrain from harming with our body and our speech and our mind. So think of something that you'd like to work on or you have been working on. Don't forget to rejoice in your progress and your efforts. And even your effort in showing up here tonight, which might be difficult for some people because of maybe either not feeling well or other issues going on in your life or even the time zone you're in. So just rejoice in your own efforts and imagine Vajrasattva is delighted with us and wanting to merge with your mind melts into white light and just kind of absorbs into you, just dissolves into you through your crown and think my uh, guru's body, speech and mind and Vajrasattva's body, speech and mind my own body, speech and mind are the same thing. So we just 
a little bit on emptiness. In emptiness, there is no I, the creator of negative karma. There is no action of creating negative karma, and there is no negative karma created. So at whatever level you understand emptiness, just place your mind there for a little while. You can think of all phenomena as being empty. They do not exist from their own side. You can also think that the way things appear to me may not necessarily be the way they exist. So let's just dedicate all the merit, all the positive energy you've created doing this purification to all living beings and think, may all the virtuous karma I've created from doing this practice ripen as my enlightenment for the sake of sentient beings as quickly as possible. Okay, for His Holiness the Dalai Lama, the wish-granting, wish-fulfilling jewel, source of every single benefit and happiness in this world, to the incomparably kind, Tenzin Gyatso, I beseech, may all your holy wishes be spontaneously fulfilled. And this is uh, Leilong Rimshay's prayer. The lamp of the Gendon, Gendon teachings, the Supreme Refuge Lama Zopa, has departed in order to rouse the Dharma, disciples who cling to permanence. Supreme being, you took upon yourself the Kadam teacher's way of life and were bound to it night and day, greatly benefiting the teachings and transmigratory beings. Great master of the teachings, supreme guide for East and West, hidden yogi, Lama Tupton Zopa. Unrivaled Lama Zopa, you took his holiness, the sovereign lord of the victorious ones as your crown and followed all his instructions. Benefactor, Lama Zopa, for the many public and personal needs of Tibetans and others, you opened the vase of resources and cleared away the suffering of hardship. One of great mind, Lama Zopa, you held helpless and voiceless animals with a mind of loving kindness and were their holy saviour and protector. Siddha Lama Zopa, lord of the ocean of mandalas, with the wings of emptiness and compassion, you crossed the waters of the generation and completion stages. Lama Tupton Zopa, great hidden yogi, ornament of the activities of the Gendon teachings, in truth, a great son of the victorious ones. With a mind of loving kindness and were there. Oh, next page. Having thought of me and other transmigratory beings of the degenerate age from your seat of lotus and sun at the heart of Sangwa Yeshi, may the jewel that fulfills all wishes emanating again with the brilliance of 10,000 suns Smile swiftly without obstacles to our eyes, teared, filled with tears of faith. Lama Ursul, Venerable One, to you whose kindness exceeds out of all the conquerors, for those wanderers in far off places, especially the West, mindful of your loving compassion, uh, loving concern for us, and intentionally descending again into a family of a far distant land, we make this request, O Lama, please, please live long. If I guess you share a beloved teacher leading your students toward wisdom and compassion, Explaining through exacting discernment the steps of the graduated path, you are the unequal guide. Please live a long and stable life. And one person left, Shayla. Do you know what time she left? Like, did she do, how many mantras did she do, do you know? She left after the mantras were done. Um, she okay, so I can add 15. Traveling. Yes, yes. Cool, thank you. Victor's also traveling right now, so he said he won't be able to come probably for about a month and he'll try and drop in all right everybody lots of love thank you so much for coming thanks for hosting and i will thank you jay and i will see you all later tomorrow maybe okay lots of love yeah. thanks everyone thank bye